Hello everybody, Dave here and all these kinds. Welcome to this week's What's on Dave's Desk. Uh, first of all, let's start with a little something that I got. Let's just move that out and zoom back out. No, I'm zooming in, Dave. Uh, yep, it's still zoomed in. Zoomed in even more. Not very good at this summer. I received today this. This is a giveaway prize that I got from Rich H. Hi, Dave Nick. Congratulations on another yet another uh, giveaway. Um, he's going to ban me. He's going to ban me now. I've had two, three, three giveaways I've won on his channel. So, looks like I'm looking for a ban on there. All the best for the church. And um, what I won was uh, 2018's Peter Rabbit. There we are. Sorry if the light's a bit off, but uh, I'm waiting for a new light to turn up. Hopefully you can see everything alright. There we go, look, tells of Peter Rabbit. Thank you very much, Rich. Uh, now know it's turned up, I'll leave a link to Rich's channel below. Although, you're probably already subscribed. Next on the agenda, I got asked a question on my last video uh, when I found the um, Active Union rotation error. Were all the error rotations the same? And the answer is yes. Um, I can't remember, it was Ian who asked me, let me just have a look, du, du, du. well organised as usual Dave, yeah, it was Ian Strudwick, uh, yeah, because if you look at the, the coin itself, when you look at the coin, the two should be always to the left and the 20, uh, 2007 to the right. So when you turn the coin, uh, it looks like the Queen is taking a nose dive. Uh, lights on there. So it's, uh, it's uh, two to the left and again. They're the two I've found recently, and this is the first one I found. Right, two to the left, and when you turn it. So all three errors that I've found have all been exactly the same. Um, and I believe, I know, well, I know they are. Rich, Rich H is, uh, who I also found two, his were exactly the same as well. So all I can assume is there's been a, a batch that have been put out and the dies have just been put in the wrong way around. Somebody at the wrong minute didn't even know what was up and what was down. The only reason I checked it is um, a lot on the photographs on their website. Uh, it, went, it shows you the both sides of the coin, that's the way it is. Two at the top left, the 2007 at the top right. Right, next thing. Um, I put a little poll out on my uh, community page about showing a bit of silver. I have a bit of silver there to show you. But before we go there, Wednesday's two, uh, 50p hunt won't be going out on Wednesday. Um, as some of you may be aware, there's a little competition going with uh, all the shot coins. And uh, I'm participating. So my Wednesday video will be going out on Friday. Uh, and his video will go up on Sunday. So that will be a two-parter. If you want to see the first part, if you nip over to see uh, Ten Bob, she did one, and then obviously uh, Tony at Old Shot Coins did the second one. Um, right, first of all, then, let's go into these bits of silver. 
This one is uh, the Australian uh, Australian from 2021 for one try ounce or 31.10 grams. It's the sixth portrait of Queen Elizabeth II by Jodie Clark. Um, the coin, this one itself, is diameter of 40.6 millimetres and a thickness of 4 millimetres. It has a milled edge, you have to take my word for it. I just want to. There we are, look through the capsule, milled edge. Uh, yep, yeah, and it's uh, this 4.9 silver, this one. Now, the reverse. We have what's that? A red kangaroo. Uh, these particular coins were struck at the Perth Mint in Australia, um, and there's no mintage figures. There's probably no mintage figures for most of these. I think I've got mintage figures for one. Now, what makes this a coin? The difference between a coin and a round, a silver round, is a coin will have a value in this case it's one dollar right, a silver round which will still be one troy ounce as a rule uh, you can get larger and smaller denominations or weights uh, because it's got one dollar on it it makes it a coin technically legal tender uh, but worth more than a dollar a silver round will just have random picture on that side a random picture on that side but it'll still be marked up as silver and uh, quite possibly you know the grade right that's coin number one coin number two is from the canadian mint it's a 2021 five dollar four nine silver um this one's 38 millimetres diameter and 3 millimetres thick. Uh, again, picture of the Queen Elizabeth II. Date, 2021, $1. And on the reverse, we have the standard Canadian maple leaf. And uh, there we are, 9999 fine silver. And repeat it again on the side in French. At the bottom we have a privy mark. I, mean, I can't zoom in enough, but inside that little mark there, it also has 21. Which is like a proof that this is a 2021. So, yeah, and this one was minted at the Royal Mint, uh, the Royal Canadian Mint in uh, Winnipeg. Next, we have a bit of an American silver. This one's from uh, 2015. It's a walk in Liberty. Uh, three nine silver. These are 40.6 millimeters. Uh, with a wear, a thickness rather of 2.98 millimeters. This particular type was struck between 1986 and 2001 when they had a new reverse fitted fitted a new reverse anyway uh, no mint mark on this one which indicates it's from the philadelphia mint uh these go that way around and on this side we have a an eagle with a shield and uh I'm led to believe, it didn't actually state where I looked, but there's 13 stars there, which I think represent the first 13 states of the uh, United States. And that is a one ounce silver dollar. And you said because it's got a, nomina a denomination, makes it a coin, not a round. Secondly, we have another walk in Liberty. Well, this one is 2022. 
uh, but this one has the new reverse which is a flying eagle holding an oak branch I'm led to believe yeah holding an oak branch again no no um, vintage face and that's uh, three nine silver uh, again from the Philadelphia Mint unfortunately no mintage figures and last one for the day is my latest acquisition is from Mexico Let me just make sure I've got it right way up uh, yeah that's the right way up I think the one in the middle is the Mexican flag I think it's Casperton flag no coat of arms sorry uh, and this one's a 2011 oh, so it's the most recent coat of arms uh, and then round the outside from 12 o'clock going clockwise you have all their other coat of arms in date order you know, one's first, second, third so on and so forth to the present date and this side we have uh, winged victory standing on a crown in the background we have the hills or mountains and Mexico City now this one has got a mintage figure of 1.2 million and if you see these were minted in Mexico so just a little bit of silver there's some more there if you want to see it leave in the description below uh, other than that I would like to say thank you very much for joining me take care everybody and we will see you next week don't forget my 50p video will be going out Friday take care everybody stay safe bye now